did the universe evolve? How did stars and galaxies form? How is the origin of life related to the universe? Now Jay is seeking answers to the deepest questions about the universe. 地球にはいつも宇宙からさまざまな光が届いています。目に見えるのは可視光だけですが、赤外線や電波などいろんな波長の光、正確に言えば電磁波が今ここにも届いているんですね。そしてその中には宇宙に関するありとあらゆる情報が織り込まれているんです。Hawaii Observatory of Naoje. The Subaru telescope gazes at the universe with its 8.2 meter diameter lens all through the night to unlock mysteries of the universe. Subaru telescope observations began in 1999. Ever since, studies using Subaru have surprised us. Among its results are those revealing formation processes of stars and planets. Evolution of galaxies and objects at the beginning of the universe. The domestic base of optical observations is Okayama Astrophysical Observatory. Since 1960, the observatory has been producing important results, in particular observing stars and interstellar matter. The observatory is also successful in observing extrasolar planets and afterglows of gamma ray bursts. Subaru and Okayama are the most important part of the world's observation. In the same way, the observation of the world's observation of the world's observation of the world's observation of the world's observation. 45 meters in diameter. The largest millimeter radio antenna in the world is at Nobeyama in Nagano Prefecture. Observing faint signals from 1 to 10 millimeter wavelength from the universe, astronomers examine how stars and planets form. Thanks to Nobeyama Radio Observatory, Japan's radio astronomy is world class. Using radio telescopes, Naoje is exploring the 3D structure of the Milky Way. Mizusawa VLBI Observatory plays a leading role in this project, precisely measuring the annual change of an object in the Milky Way. Based on changes due to Earth's orbital motion, researchers can derive distance to objects. Thus, we can obtain a 3D map of the Milky Way. Naoje is part of an international project called ALMA. In a remote part of the Chilean Andes. In March 2013, ALMA formally became a fully fledged observatory. Now Jay is responsible for the development and manufacture of 16 out of 66 antennae. How did the first galaxy form after the Big Bang? The stars? The planets? Does space hold the origin of life? ALMA will be a key for unlocking answers to these questions. 天文学の分野で世界最先端の成果を出し続けるためにはこれまでにない観測装置の開発が必要になります国立天文台ではここ先端技術センターがその役割を担ってきました ATC is a unique branch of NAOJ At ATC, astronomers themselves can design and develop the instruments they want to use Skilled engineers use various machine tools to produce sophisticated instrument components. In ATC's clean room, superconductive devices are produced, the central part of a radio telescope. ATC's measuring technique can inspect products with accuracy of less than one micrometer. Here in the ATC, ALMA designed and developed the world's highest sensitivity receivers. Subjecting them to a series of rigorous tests before delivering them to the ALMA Observatory. The technology and techniques accumulated in ATC were applied to Hinode Solar Observational Satellite. ATC's capabilities for ground based astronomy are also appreciated at space observatories. 
He noticed unprecedented instruments surprised people all over the world by uncovering amazing solar phenomena. Precious observational data obtained by ground-based and space telescopes. Observational data is expanding due to rapidly advancing instruments. The Astronomical Data Center maintains high-performance network and data archive systems and distributes them to scientists all over the world. The Astronomical Data Center plays a leading role in astronomical research using archived big data. Computational astrophysics is one of the most active research fields at Naoji. Researchers try to understand the unobservable universe by means of simulations. At the Center for Computational Astrophysics, researchers reproduce various phenomena in computers. The day is coming when mysteries of solar system formation and galactic evolution can be solved in computers. Along with producing leading results in astrophysics using state-of-the-art instruments, Naoje has played an important role since 1869. Naoje computes celestial events related to the calendar, such as equinoxes, eclipses, sunrises, and sunsets. Based on our calculation of vernal and autumnal equinoxes, the government determines national holidays. We announce a summary in the first official gazette issued in February. 国立天文台は一般の方への情報発信にも力を入れています。星や宇宙への好奇心は研究者だけのものではありません。国立天文台の主要な施設はいつでも見学することができますし、また実際に天体を覗いていただく観望会も定期的に行っています。夜空を見上